Hi, so I'm going to test um, uh, the engineer, engineer's beta uh, 2.1. Uh, I've been on the ground for a while and um, I noticed basically that things like salvageable wreckages are persistent, or it seems like they're persistent until raided. Um, so yeah, I, I sort of went up and visited this, this wreck and I was uh, kind of surprised to see exactly how uh, exactly how large this wreckage was. Um, you can see the lighting popping in, possibly some of the, the actual wreckage spawning. Um, so it does look a little bit weird, but um, yeah, when it's finished, uh, it's as you can see, it's, it's pretty extensive. Um, and it's just uh, wreckage components um, as a legal salvage and nothing else. So I was, I was kind of hoping that there would be, there'd be some of the, the new um, um, maybe data blocks or um, manufactured materials for engineers uh, but that was not the case so uh, since I do not actually have any cargo space on my Fertilance I decided I would just move on yeah you can see basically the, what this looks like several wreckages of uh, Imperial ships and also uh, possibly a Viper or two. Either way, pretty big bat. Pretty big um, fight. So I moved systems. Um, yeah, so this is how the new signal sources uh, work. You basically get a signal source and then as you approach it, you will we get a little description. So this was um, uh, shots fired essentially for level two. So I dropped in and I found essentially um, friendly and free en enemies. So I thought I'd just engage them. So this is the first time I've been playing with the new, uh, the new AI and also the new heat system. So um, bear in mind that it's uh, a little bit out of practice. I'm also uh, sporting the uh, uh, huge uh, multi cannon on the bottom. I'm not sure why and how effective I am shooting small ships with it. Either way, uh, this guy doesn't appear to have very much armor, so uh, you can see I'm just sort of chewing through. It's done. Cool. <laughs> That's always good. So what happens as well is that the uh, the ships will drop, as you can see, uh, they'll drop materials. So these work exactly like the planetary materials, um, and you collect these and use them for engineers. So every single ship will drop a few. So you can see I, I sort of pause here, I make a mistake, I, I, I go sign up running because I'm actually trying to figure out how to open my cargo uh, scoop. It's, 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 I just realized essentially that my cargo hatch was offline. Um, so, yeah. anyway. Uh, since this is only beach, I'm not too worried about getting my ship damaged. Uh, I'm pretty sure I should get a hold of um, Yeah, so, <laughs> just take this take this guy on. I dropped his shields. Uh, drop his shields pretty quickly. See if I can make short work of him too. So he's uh, rated dangerous, and so his, his uh, ship probably is a little bit better fitted. And um, you can see, he's actually doing a good job of essentially keeping his nose pointed at me at all times. So I might have to try something in first time to Yep, uh, so this seems like the old jousting, um, which was a good feature. <laughs> I say good feature, but I just say a feature of the old uh, AI is gone. And so, yeah, we, we're going to have to change it out strategies uh, quite a lot. It sounds flying everywhere. Yeah, so. Will definitely take a little bit again. Anyway, um, just got to make sure what this guy. Uh, yeah, here we go. 
Who is jumping? Chat. That's crazy. I'm not sure how much uh, the person at the helping is actually hitting me. Ooh, sounds. I must just say, actually, the um, the extra sort of announcements that the void that the group voice makes, and uh, I don't know whether we've changed up any sound effects at all, but the missiles definitely seem to be cool. And there we go. So at this point, um, there, there is one person left, but I basically. Uh, I held here for a few moments. So that's about it. Um, the rest of it is just me picking up materials. Catch you later, guys.